Welcome! In this video, I'm going to show you how to add your own website bio that will appear in the front page of your real estate website. If we scroll down the page, you'll notice that there's a small About Me section within the front page. We're going to edit this section so that we can add more information about what you can offer. So, scroll down to the very bottom of the page and then click on User Login. Now, enter your username and password and click on Login. This will take you to the dashboard where you can make as many changes to your real estate website. To make changes to your website bio, simply click on your name and then Profile Manager. This will take you to the page where you can edit your profile. So we're going to scroll down until you see Real Estate Agents Details and Website Bio. Now it's just a matter of entering information about yourself so you can let your visitors know about who you are and what you have to offer and how you're different from other realtors in the community. So I'm going to go ahead and paste some information that I've prepared for my website bio. And then I'm going to scroll down and over here I can also enter the areas that I cover. For example, if there are certain cities, towns, or neighborhoods that you specialize in, you can enter that information here. And if there are any additional languages that you speak, you can always choose from the drop-down list here. If you have more than one language that you speak, you can easily click on that and then browse for another language. And while you're pressing control on your keyboard, you can also select the other languages. If you've accidentally selected a language and want to deselect that that language, you can also hold down the control button on your keyboard and click on the unwanted language. To the right, you have an education box where you can enter your credentials. And then to the right, there's a speciality box where you can talk about what you specialize in, perhaps their pre-construction condos, commercial properties, residential homes, and much more. And then you also have additional boxes where you can identify the number of years of your experience, any awards and qualifications that you may have, and perhaps your tax ID, license number, and since you've been licensed. Once complete, you can scroll down, make sure that the I agree box has been checked off under portal provider agreement, and then press save. To view the changes you've made, simply click on your domain at the very top here, which will take you to the front end of your website. Now scroll down to the area of your website with your About Me section and you should be able to see the content that we just added.